Good morning, everybody. It's David with Parts and Pieces. How are you doing this morning? I hope everybody's having a great day. It is a beautiful, partly cloudy, but cool morning here in Florida. Um, I wanted to take a second today before I started my, uh, my daily routine. I want to tell everybody, thank you very much. Um, all the people that supported me doing this little video thing, um, all the people that's helped me so much, especially my wife and my daughter, um, I have a few friends that have done some stuff for me to help me out with this to make this possible. Um, I have a few friends that the property you saw me on the first time is a um, is the property of a couple friends of mine that that was actually a gun range that I was on. Um, they gave me permission to shoot and drive in that gun range. Thankfully, it is a nice place to ride. I uh, I will take care of it um, if I do mess anything up. I'll fix it with a tractor um, it means a lot to me just with the few videos I posted I can I guess what I'm saying is I can see why my daughter does this stuff and I can see why she gets so excited I can see why the kids get so excited about the YouTube thing especially when they do it um, I remember you know when she first started she'd be so antsy when she put her first video on waiting for you know upload and all that and she would be telling me about it you know, I listened to her and stuff, but I didn't do it, so I didn't understand a lot of it. Well, now I do, and it's a lot of work. It's a lot of work to upload a video, um, edit it, and all that good stuff. Uh, the editing ain't too, too bad, depending on how long your video is and how much you want to do to it. But, and to get back to what I said, I just really appreciate everything from everybody, all the people that's helped me out. Um, all the people on YouTube that have viewed my videos. I hope they were entertaining um, Everybody that subscribed to that. I appreciate it. That's awesome Like I said, thank you again for all the uh, Likes and comments and uh, people subscribing um, Really didn't expect that uh, Especially the views that was pretty neat. Um, so I think I'm doing something right Maybe uh, just in the short amount of time with a few videos. I hope it keeps growing the more it grows the more I'll do that's just you know the way it is I guess it, it, the more I get the more y'all get into it the more I will the more things I'll do the more I'll show y'all um, like I said if y'all want to get this to where it's a daily or a daily daily thing you know I'll make you a video you can sit down in the afternoon every day and watch if you want one of these five seven days a week we can make that happen I just want to know if y'all are that interested in it or not um, if I'm doing this good enough and I wanted to come down here today um, to let y'all know that and I wanted to show y'all something. I'm I'm really brainstorming on what kind of content, what to do with Ratchet. Like I told you, I want to test him. It, it just seemed, I want, I want to push him to some of his limits. I'm going to take care of him. I'm not going to destroy him. Don't think that. I'm not that way. I'm very OCD when it comes to my stuff and I'll push him and I'll push my stuff but I I maintenance it I clean it I take care of it if it breaks I fix it that's just the way it is but you have it for a reason so why not use it for that reason right you baby it you what's the point in having it but I've been thinking about some stuff and I told y'all he's never been in the mud I really want him in the mud uh, I know that's what most people want to see um, so it's taken me, I, like I told you in the video, I, I have a couple of areas around me. One of them I wouldn't drive through to save my life, to be honest with you. And the other one, I'm gonna have to talk to some people, but I think it'll be all right uh, just to make one or two short videos as long as I don't tear the area up. Um, it will, it's perfect for what I need. I'm gonna take a second, I'm gonna show you all what I'm looking at. Um, it, it could come up later in the later on in a video and if it does I will let you know if this happens and I'll give you a date and time of when I'm gonna do it and about when I'm gonna try to get the video posted um, but enough talking let's take a look at this real quick all right before I show you this I have this itch with this mower I built ratchet when I put them tires on him I had this idea and I thought that, you know, have you ever seen the shows of Bigfoot and some of them other ones with the big tires on it? Some of this other stuff that people build that have these big balloon tires on them. 
what do they do in water they float ratchet like i told you in the last video is very very light i did make him as light as possible but as sturdy as possible but i can lift him with one arm really literally i can lift him with one arm on the front little you know it ain't as easy it ain't easy but i can lift him um if he got stuck or i had to get in a bind it would be no trouble for me to pick the front of that up and move it out of a hole or whatever or flip it over if i had to and the rear end it's just as light technically to be honest with you if you saw in the pitch wrap two little bars coming out on each side of the uh of the uh toolbox on the back they uh i haven't done it yet but i am going to extend them bars out just enough to put um like bicycle handles on them um, what that's for is if my rear end gets hung up I need to get it out and I don't feel like I don't like grabbing the fenders It'll cut your hand, but I'm gonna put them little bars on there And that's just gonna be one extra thing that helps me if I get in the bug get stuck It makes it where one person can still get it out pretty easy um, But what I'm about to show you is I was telling you earlier I think I told you this is a buddy's property. I'm on right now. Actually, it's a couple buddies of mine um, they've been doing me a big favor. They helped me out with the first videos. That was the gun range I was on. Awesome place to ride. Um, really nice ride too. Nobody around, quiet, everything. But what I'm about to show you, I have to talk to them about because they've been redoing this area for a while, making it nice and neat. It didn't look that great for a long time, but they've done a lot of work to it and it looks really nice. I've done some of the work to it with the uh, Traco on the back part. I cleared out a bunch of woods that were all in the muck with the Traco, big Traco, it was fun too. Um, I love running equipment. It's like running a big Tonka toy. Uh, that'll clear your mind in about five seconds. But the, uh, like I was saying, this little area I'm at, I'm fixing to show y'all, is theirs. They've done a lot of work to clean it up um there's one spot i want to drive i want to make a video through run through it a couple times it ain't going to do anything to it but what i'm getting at is i'm gonna go ahead and show you and stop talking i get to rambling on and i'm sorry about that um now you see how much editing i got to do in a video but all right this hold on a second all right this pond is there's not it's it's pretty big actually but the like three quarters of it is covered in saw blade grass, all kinds of stuff, uh, muck, everything. You can actually walk across it and it's like walking across a big sponge once you get out through there and walk back in there. I actually had the track go walking across a lot of that with some homemade bridges I built as I went to get out to get some of that stuff. That was kind of sketchy because the thing was sitting here just doing this across the bridges. It was fun, fun experience, but I got it done. Um, anyhow this right here what i want to do and this is what this is what i'm thinking and y'all tell me if you would like to see this i want to get some comments rolling in on some of this stuff i want y'all to talk to me um if it's you know criticism on what you want me to do or what i should do let me know that's what i'm here for uh that's what i want i'm not gonna be upset or anything like that y'all want want me to do some certain thing or change something or have a question any of that i'm not that person that's going to be offended let me know um if you don't think i did something right let me know um and we'll talk about it like i said i got reasons and all that stuff for everything i do and maybe i could change your mind or you possibly could change mine that's all part of it that's how you help each other um you don't need to get mad and all that stuff that everybody else does a lot on here and stuff i don't want that that's not what this whole page is about I want interaction. I want to talk. I want to get along with everybody. I want everybody to have fun. Back to what I was saying. Point being, I want to see if I can float ratchet from... Let me get my camera to come back on so I can see what I'm doing here. From probably in this area right here where I'm pointing. Let me walk over here real quick. Somewhere right in here would be a good takeoff for me i think um i would want to go i know i can't make it over the saw blade grass that's out here i don't think i'm gonna walk over there and look but i don't want to mess any of that up um what i was thinking was is right here right here across would be a good little test you can't tell on the video but 
uh from my finger out to about right here that's a good seven feet out i'd say eight feet um for how deep it is i'm not quite for sure uh the pond does raise and lower so it really depends on what day i i decide to use this i would rather have it on a day like this so i'll probably talk to the guy who does the pump out here and runs the water out here and see what day he's going to pump it down or have it pumped down or if it's going to stay pumped down because if it gets pumped up the water it's pretty deep i don't want to sink it i don't want to ruin it so i know i have a good maybe a couple feet before i really mess anything up and i'm gonna say if i follow the edge but keep my tires in here it's pretty steep incline once you get in the water uh it every foot foot and a half it drops a foot so technically i don't even want to go out that far but what i want to do is i want to bring it out here i want to see if that thing will float i have to do a few things to it like i told you i don't run air in them tires i don't have to i don't need to um i don't even want to worry it's fun not to have to worry about it but guys this little area right here this is this is what i'm hoping after i talk to a couple of my buddies they say it's okay to make one or two videos here see what that little uh little mower will do i say little mower he ain't little but I think Ratchet can make it through it. It's, hold on a second. I haven't been out here in a while. It's pretty firm. Long as you don't have something heavy, like really, really heavy. And that's where and why I built Ratchet like I did. He is lightweight. And I mean really light for a mower. It's crazy. That red snapper weighs twice as much as him. And Ratchet's twice as big as the snapper. But uh, stuff like this, guys. I don't know if you can tell, but that is some nasty thick gooey muck that's not mud that's muck if you're from florida you know what i'm talking about um but i figure if this is like this right here we'll give it some test runs through some of the not so bad stuff and we'll work our way around all right guys I got to get to my day, but I really want to stop by and show you this. This is what I had in my mind. Um, yes, I want to see if Ratchet's amphibious or not. And if he's not, I want to make him that way. And that will probably be one thing I do. Not amphibious as in um, boat motor and all that. Make him amphibious. Make him for what he is amphibious. And I got a couple ideas I'm going to show y'all. Um, that's one reason I did the wheels the way I did, uh, and I will explain that later. Um, but there are alligators in here and snapping turtles, so that might be interesting too. I'm putting myself in that situation, by the way, to make this video. I hope you watch. Um, I'm joking, guys. There are that stuff in here, though. I'm serious. Um, what do y'all want? Y'all want to see this? This is one of my big things. Um, one of my main things I want to do with the mower. Hope this... Hope this is something that y'all really want to see. That's why it's a nice area. I can shoot some nice video and we can all have a little bit of fun with it. Guys, thank you again for watching. I'm trying and I will, I think I can conquer this. I think I can. Hopefully y'all are here to watch it. Y'all have a great day. Um, I'll see y'all soon. Uh, like, comment, subscribe. I uh, appreciate every one of y'all. Uh, I will talk to y'all later. Have a great day.